The Wizard of Ads is a collection of insights and strategies for individuals and businesses to improve advertising, marketing, and communication skills. Authored by Roy H. Williams, also known as The Wizard of Ads, the book delves into the psychology behind successful advertising and offers practical advice for crafting compelling messages that resonate with audiences. Core Message At the heart of Williams's philosophy is the idea that effective advertising does not rely on large budgets or flashy gimmicks, but on a deep understanding of human nature and the principles of persuasion. He argues that small businesses can compete with large corporations by being more creative, more in tune with their customers, and by telling more compelling stories in their advertisements. Advertising and Human Nature Williams emphasizes the psychological aspects of advertising, explaining how certain words and images can trigger an emotional response in consumers. He points out that advertisements should aim to reach the heart and not just the mind. By tapping into the desires, hopes, fears, and dreams of the audience, advertisers can create powerful connections that drive consumer behavior. Memorable Messages Crafting memorable messages is integral to successful advertising. Williams discusses the importance of simplicity and clarity, advising that messages should be understandable, relatable, and repeatable. He also suggests using poetic techniques like alliteration, rhythm, and repetition to make an ad's message stick in the minds of the audience. Storytelling. Storytelling is a recurring theme in the book. Williams asserts that stories are inherently persuasive and that advertisers should leverage this by incorporating narrative elements into their campaigns. A good story can captivate an audience, making the message more impactful and memorable. The Three Worlds Williams describes three worlds that advertisers can appeal to. The external world, physical realities, the internal world, feelings and emotions, and the spiritual world, beliefs and values. He explains that the most successful ads often touch on elements from all three, creating a holistic message that speaks to multiple aspects of the consumer's life. Media Selection When it comes to selecting the right media for advertising, Williams advises that reach and frequency are key considerations. He explains that while it might be tempting to focus on the medium with the largest audience, it is often more effective to choose a medium that allows for frequent repetition of the ad, ensuring that it is seen or heard multiple times by the target demographic. Branding and Identity Williams discusses the importance of branding, explaining that a company's identity should be carefully crafted and consistently presented across all platforms. He believes that a strong brand becomes a shorthand for the company's values and promises, making it easier for customers to remember and recognize. The risk of boredom. A notable risk in advertising is the creator's own boredom with successful campaigns. Williams warns against changing an effective message too frequently out of a desire for novelty. Consistency is critical, as it can take time for a message to penetrate the consciousness of the target audience. Persuasion Techniques Williams describes various techniques to persuade consumers, including the use of authority figures, social proof, and the principle of scarcity. By understanding how these and other persuasive techniques work, advertisers can craft messages that are more likely to result in a sale. The Role of Art in Advertising while some ads are purely functional, aiming to inform consumers about a product or service, Williams highlights the role of art in advertising. He believes that ads should also seek to entertain, engage, and provoke thought. This artistic approach can help ads stand out in a crowded marketplace. Customer Relationships Williams stresses the importance of building and maintaining strong relationships with customers. He believes that trust and loyalty are far more valuable than any single transaction and that advertisers should aim to create long-term relationships with their audiences through honesty, integrity, and consistent delivery on promises. Product versus Offer In distinguishing between the product and the offer, Williams notes that the product is what you sell, but the offer is how you sell it. The offer encompasses the terms, conditions, pricing, and extras that come with the product, and it can often be the deciding factor for a consumer who is choosing between similar products. Sensory engagement. Engaging multiple senses in advertising can have a powerful effect on consumers. Williams suggests using vivid descriptions, evocative sounds, 
and other sensory elements to create an immersive experience that will make the advertisement more effective. Testing and measurement. To determine the effectiveness of advertising efforts, Williams insists on the importance of testing different approaches and measuring results. By tracking which ads generate responses and which don't, businesses can refine their strategies and concentrate their resources on the most effective messages. Adaptability. The advertising environment is constantly changing, and Williams advocates for adaptability. He recommends staying abreast of consumer trends, technological advancements, and cultural shifts, and being willing to adjust advertising strategies accordingly. In summary, The Wizard of Ads is a comprehensive guide to creating advertising that captures attention, engages emotions, and persuades consumers. By combining a deep understanding of human psychology with practical advice and creative strategies, Roy H. Williams provides readers with the tools they need to elevate their advertising campaigns connect with customers, and drive business success. The underlying message of the book is that advertising is both an art and a science, and those who master it can turn their businesses and their dreams into realities. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.